Alright guys, I am going to do the YouTube challenge and upload a video to YouTube. However, I'm going to create I look number two um, that is antsy, nimble, marvelous, and optimistic with different colors. We're going to use gentle, unabashed, optimistic, and... Um, to get the same look, we'll probably use gingerly. I'm going to try and create that same look, but with four different colors, believe it or not. Well, optimistic will, will be one that'll stay, okay? So for the very first one, you're supposed to use ANSI. I'm gonna come in and I'm going to use Visionary as my base color. Now we're gonna try and get this as close as possible to this look, but showing you that you could use different colors to come up with this almost same look. And to be honest with you, I don't have those other colors other than optimistic, so I knew that I could create it. Nevertheless. But Mama does want those colors, so. So all we're doing is creating that base all over your lid, okay? Nice. All right, so the next color they have is Nimble. We are going to use, what did I say? Not gullible, did I say gullible? We'll use gullible in lieu of marvelous. So for the next color, Nimble, we're gonna go ahead and use, not sure. I thought I had this mapped out. Hold on. That's a purplish color. No, yeah, it's a purplish pink. Can't use that. Hold tight. Optimistic is for the corner eye. We need a peachy kind of look. All right, we're gonna go in with the peachy. Instead of nimble, we're going to use manipulative. And we're gonna take that in the corner right here and just right above the brow bone. And we wanna start with less, and this is buildable shadow. So build it up to your liking, and we're trying to match this color, so, or this look, I should say. Just like this. This is such a pretty color, you guys. I can't, I can't help but really love it. And I keep my eyes open because I like it at the top. And you definitely want to do that. Even, I, I mean, I don't have completely hooded eyes, but I have enough where I want to see a little bit more. Okay? All right, so that's going to be our second color. If I want more, and I think I need to add a little bit more for that look. I will. Okay, now we're just going to take a, a darker brownish color. We're gonna go with Gullible. It's a chocolate matte. We're gonna take that chocolate matte and we're going to just put that in our crease. Corner and crease, Let's, just like this. Just Pop it in, just like that. Okay. 
Okay, so we're trying to create a really pretty brown. Just like that. Almost like a V, okay? Popping it in that right there. And making sure to close your eyes or not really close the lid a little bit to make sure you get that V kind of look like that. Isn't that pretty? You don't want any harsh lines. Just make sure that you're All right, we got that. Just like that. Now we gotta add in Optimistic and we're gonna put that in the corner. And we're gonna lighten it up just a teeny bit because I do have uh, Alive as it used in another, another video. So we're just gonna use the Optimistic real quick. That's this color right here. And we're gonna put that Excuse me. Bit of a cold. We're going to use that and pop that in our corner with a small tool like this, okay? We're just going to put that here to liven up our eye. Do you see how that? I just want to show you really quick how that does that. See how this eye looks like, whoa, I did get some sleep there. And this one looks a little dull. That's what that little bit does by putting that in that corner of your eye. Believe it or not, that is an amazing trick. can't really tell. I have to close my eyes. I'm also going to slip this. I know it doesn't show it on there, but I'm going to slip this at the top just to add a little bit of pop. Just like that. And we're going to go back in and see how this looks compared to that. Okay. So give me one moment. Ah, oh, the sniffles drives me nuts, you guys. Sorry about that. Um, okay. Let me grab, just in case I have another moment. Grab another napkin. All right, so I gotta make this 15 minutes or less. So I wanna show you that that is just a beautiful eye, but I've got four colors in there. Isn't that great? And I might wanna smoke out, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna just add a little bit more of what did we use manipulative now i don't need any more of that let me drop some more chocolate in here That looks good. Okay, that looks great. And we're just gonna close our eyes and we're going to show that. Um, I'm gonna take a picture really quick using this phone. So hang tight guys, before I finish my um, under eye here as well as my mascara. Okay, well, I stopped the video. I just added a little bit more, so I'm going to scrunch those videos together to show you. Um, but I will go ahead and continue with the liner and mascara because I really want 
to accent what we're doing with our um, with our promotion and I don't think that I showed enough on the mascara earlier so I actually took off my complete eye and I did that so I want you to see the full look so I'm going to go ahead and finish that for you guys and hopefully both of them together will be under 15 minutes And it is National Lash Day. So what I'm doing is I'm taking our primer, which is part of the trio, and applying it to the back, to the front, and wiggling it, and getting a really good coverage. I am going to take this one and chuck it because I need a new a new one so just need to start that over because you have to replace your mascaras every day okay since I'm going to be on another competition real quick you guys I am going to let you go and let you know that well I can actually take a picture hopefully I won't cut off again I'll take a picture of one eye and not the other so and hope that we don't get cut off again if we do I'll have to cut three together okay in fact, I'm going to do that. I'm going to end it and cut it back in, see if I can't cut it in. 